Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. It has been so long since I have done a makeup tutorial, but this one isn't even a full makeup tutorial. It's just on how I got this lime green eye, you know, we're in a neon mood this summer. So I went ahead and you know, we got the lime green crop top. Let's, let's go down and check out this wardrobe. We got a lime green crop top, lime green, pencil well short mini skirt bam bam thank you ma'am so that is my look this is the final look so look out and i hope you enjoyed this video I'm a Hey loves, welcome back to my channel. Wah, wah, wah. So let's get into these eyes. First, we're gonna start out with the Watch Me Blush palette from the crayon case, and we're gonna go into Cobbler. Yes. So we're gonna go into that with the Morphe M433 brush. Focus, focus. And we're gonna go ahead and blend that. I blended it high up. This is gonna be like my transition color. We're only using three colors today. We're gonna make it real simple. Okay, baby, so next we're going to go in with the pigment. This pigment is from MyoMakeup.com. I believe I ordered this from Ipsy, but that is the website, and I will make sure that I leave it in the description. So I'm going in with that same Morphe M433 brush, and we're just going to try to pack that on. Um, and I am going to let you guys know that this is not, this pigment is not blendable at all, and you have to pack on a lot. So you kind of kind of have to be kind of hand beat handy heavy handed with this see that yes we're going for a neon look this summer baby yes yes and you see me trying to blend it and then after a while I realized that um, you can't blend this Okay, so on from here, we're going to go into the Take Me Back to Brazil palette, and I'm going to go into that neon green looking color right there. And we're going to take that and put that in between Cobbler and this uh, pigment, and that's going to kind of give us a better transition than it looking so blotchy like it's looking right now.
hair I am dipping back into cobbler and we're gonna go ahead and blend that out so we get a immaculate finish need to enhance my vocabulary Okay, love, so let's move on to liner. This is LA Girl Matte Eyeliner Pen. It's in white. I had trouble one opening it and two applying this. Look, girl, don't break your teeth. So this is it zoomed in, and I'm also going to zoom in of me applying this liner. It is not that pigmented. Um, it's pigmented on my hand, but it picks up the color. I don't know, I struggle. See, I'm looking real confused. I'm trying to shake it, trying to do everything in my power to get this color to pay off. I push it on that palette to try to get it to leak out. I did some of everything. It looks good on camera, but in person, it was not that hot. Like, you can barely see it. So, after a while, I went in with my black liner from Morphe, I believe it was. And then I tried to apply that over it, leave the white in the inner part of the black liner. That didn't look too hot. So after a while, we just went ahead and went with the all black liner. This is what I got with the black liner. Coming up is the final look. I hope you guys love it. I hope you like, comment, and subscribe. Booty like I. Don't like me. Gonna fight tight enough. What they do?